In today's Apple Numbers spreadsheet demonstration, I'm going to show you how to use the R total. So here we have a very basic sales spreadsheet. And let's say, for instance, we want to sum January sales. So we're going to highlight this cell here, B7, and you can press the equals key and then highlight all the cells and then press enter. That will sum the total of January sales. However, let's delete that quickly and you can highlight the cell and then come up to insert and then simply press sum and it'll automatically sum all the cells for you. Now you don't need to keep doing the auto sum. You can press this little yellow tab here, click it once and hold and drag it into the next cells that you want to auto sum. As you can see, C7 and D7 are now auto summed. February and March is sales. Now let's say we want to total stands overall sales. So we can click in E2 and then we can press the equals key and then type sum and then select all of stands sales and then press enter and all of stands sales will be totaled. However, it's easy again to use auto sum. So we'll delete stand sales there. Then we'll highlight the cell again, E2. Then we'll select insert and then sum. And as you can see, stand sales are auto summed. Again, you can click the little yellow tab and drag this down and drag the auto sum down to calculate all the other sales of all the other team members. So that's how to use the auto sum in Apple numbers. Hope you found that useful and thanks for watching.